Hi, my name is Rushab, and today we are going to see how to calculate the time difference between two given times. This would be very useful, for example, to calculate how long did a customer care executive take to resolve an issue on a call, or how long did a runner take to complete his race. Let's see this. First, create a structure like this. Then, in the start and end time, select a particular time format. So first you select the columns, then in the home tab, go to the format options and go to more number formats. You could also go to this particular box of format cells using the shortcut control plus one. Here, go to time and I like this format, you can choose it too and press OK. Let's enter a sample time, 4 p.m. As soon as I press tab, automatically it's taken the format that I wanted. Here I'm saying end time is 4.05 p.m. Similarly, fill more data. Now let's calculate the time difference between the two times using equal to text formula. Equal to text, take the end time first minus the start time, comma, Put the format text as hh colon mm colon ss in double quotes, close the bracket. This is for hours, minutes and seconds. Press enter. Wow! So in one shot we know that the exact time difference between these two times is 5 minutes and 0 seconds. Let's copy this formula down. We got for each of it. Now let's add some insights to our data using the formula equal to if. What we want to know is whether the customer service executive has resolved a particular issue on the phone in 5 minutes or has he crossed 5 minutes. So basically 5 minutes is something which is acceptable. Beyond that is not very good for his ratings. How do we measure this? Thus, to see if he has crossed the time limit, we need to basically check three parameters. If the number of hours is more than zero, he has crossed it. If the number of minutes is more than 5, again he has crossed it. If the number of minutes is 5, but the number of seconds is more than 0, he has again crossed it. Or else he is within the time. Yes? Easy to understand? Let's put the formula. Equal to if. Let's take the first condition. So we want to check whether the hour of this particular time is more than 0. That's our first condition. If it is, we want to say crossed. Comma. Now the first condition has been checked. Now the second condition will have to be put in the value if false of the if formula, which we can also call as nested if, if under if. So for the second condition, we put if again and we check minute of this particular cell to be more than 5. Are you getting it? It's very simple. Basically, the formula if has three things. First, the condition, then the value of true, then the value of false. So once we mention the condition, a condition can either be true or either be false, right? If the condition is true, we want the word crossed to appear. If it is false, we want to check the next condition as simple as that. So the second condition is what we mentioned, minutes more than 5, comma, again we write crossed. For the third condition, we have to check two things, whether the minutes is equal to 5 and the number of seconds is more than 0. So here we will have to say if and minutes of this particular cell is equal to 5 comma second of this particular cell is more than 0. Close the bracket for the AND comma crossed again or else now all our conditions are over. So then we can say in double quotes within time that is our value of false and close the number of brackets required for the IF and press ENTER. So Roy in his first call has completed in exactly 5 minutes. That's why it says within time. Let's copy this formula down and check. 
superb. For James's first call, it's within time, 1 minute and 17 seconds. Roy, 16 minutes and 47 seconds, so he's crossed the time limit and so forth. Let's also add some insights using conditional formatting. So first, select this column without the header. Go to the Home tab, Conditional Formatting, Highlight Cell Rules, Text that contains. Here, type crossed and fill it with red color and say OK. So anytime you want to visually see what all calls have been crossed beyond the time limit, it appears in red color. Beautiful. Thank you for watching.